Hey guys, Quackenstein Monster here, and welcome to the gaming experience of Spider-Man: Return of the Sinister Six for the NES. And of course, it's brought to you by GameAnyone.com. More LJN Spider-Man, you say? Why the hell not? Okay, let you read that for a moment. All right, and this. I gotta say the sprite work. All right, I gotta let you know right now the controls are a little wonky, so. Maybe looking the. Making this look easy, but trust me, I had to reverse the fucking controls because normally jump like San Mario. Well, that's uh, your attack, and attack is a uh, is uh, your jump button here. Um, also, I saw that the Super Gaming Brothers had done this one and tried it, wanted to track this one out for myself, and it's not a terrible game, like the nerd made it out to be, though it's... Not the greatest Spider-Man in the world. I've already done a playthrough of that one. Swing on inside and... Fuck you. Alright, as you can tell, these uh, jackasses explode when hit, so. As you can tell, I'm not having any troubles. You. And of course, I am using a controller for this game. Of course, it's just being um, emulated, so. Alright, so this one isn't very long. Alright, get the key, use it on the door, tap up to enter doors. the first boss, hit the switch. Come on, get your bitch ass up here. There you go. You get nice little damage there. Come on. Get your bitch ass up here. Get up here. Oh, 
Oh my god, this guy's being another dick! Get down here so I can punch him in the mouth! Listen here! Oh, get down here! Oh, get down here, you electric bastard! Come on! Yep. There! Alright, Sandman appears with a fist of fury. And sand! Lots and lots of sand. Alright, here we are looking for um, dynamite. And of course, a detonator. Alright, just as you can tell, just pushing down on an item makes you collect it. Now, you're probably wondering why am I playing this shitty ass game? Oh, come on, I've beaten this one already. Ugh, come on, webhead. Alright, this is a case where you need a short web underneath the bottom so you can start swinging. Safe stating. Uh. All right, we're going to save state. pause until I get back up there. Be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. I figured it out. There we go. There we 
go. And of course, after all that, I'm so safe stating that. kill you very dead there we go no matter if I come down here or not my goal is is straight up now For well, well, this dynamite's being used here. Come down here and boom. And the Sandman awaits. Deals with him. Spider Man hunts for Mysterio, the master of illusion. Oh, this lovely little fucking shitstorm of a stage. As you can tell, it's not going to be very long. We're already um, third of the way done with the game, actually. Keep going through these doors. <laughs> now, one thing of note you should know about this game. One life, one continue. That's all you fucking get. Tell the lights are out in this area. There we go. Lights back on. So you don't fuck me over. asshole. Ugh. 
By the way, if I wasn't cheating, I would have been very, very dead by now. Actually, just ducking down and hitting these bastards seems to work pretty damn good. And we gotta fight about three or four of these guys. But the strategy is just the same. Duck. And punch. And Mysterio is down for the count. Vulture swoops for Spider Man. As you can see, I'm just trying to get through this as fast as possible. Don't want to make this into two parts. Uh, just to let you know, I do plan on doing uh, The Amazing Spider-Man uh, 2 and 3 for the Game Boy as well. But uh, well, there's going to be a little bit of a gap in between. Besides, I got a shit, real shit storm of a game planned for you soon. And I have no idea what I was thinking when I thought of the idea. Flip your wings, asshole. Come on. Ugh. All right, as you can tell, that green bar down the lower... Our uh, lower left is the uh, over here. Shenanigans. There we go. Vulture's down. Once he was human, now he's hobgoblin. All right, now we got a bunch of these uh, overpowered mooks in here. They'll get into you. They'll club you. You're far enough away. They'll throw their shit at you. Well, with you know me and my cheating ways. Anyway, Hobgoblin. Come on. Just slightly tap the attack button while you get one of those uh, cartridges and you can shoot a web. Funny thing is, it doesn't require web cartridges, thankfully, to do that web slinging stunt. Anyway, this is the fifth stage. 
And I'm gonna go hit. Close in. Boom! And masterminding the mayhem. Dr. Octopus is back with a vengeance. We are almost done with the game, guys. I gotta say, it did take me a little bit to complete this game the first time. As you can tell, we got every fucking mook in the goddamn game after us. Fuck you. I'm out of here. I don't care about scores. I just want to get to the end. Might as well consider this the Summer of Spider-Man. Sorry, I said I got a real shit storm of a game for you coming up here soon. Once again, it'll be for the Sega Genesis. Get down here. Fuck you. Just like with Mysterio, we got multiples of these guys. Get down here. And there we go. We just beat the game, guys. Victory, Spider-Man triumphs over the Sinister Six. So yeah, that was uh, Spider-Man Re uh, Return of the Sinister Six for the NES. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed watching this as much as well, I kind of enjoyed playing it. I will say it's a bit of a guilty pleasure of mine with uh, infinite health on, so uh, there you go. Uh, see you next time for another short Spider-Man game. It might be The Amazing Spider-Man 2 for the Game Boy, but who knows? But whatever it is, I'll see you guys then. Later, everyone.